All-time favorite card trick. You're kidding, that's amazing. I'm not, I'm not even kidding. Do this I uses four aces, so okay. to find the four aces, the first one jumps out like, there's ace one and two, Ooh, there is three and four. What? All four aces, but check this out. So to start, I want to prove to you that they're all face up. That's ace of spades face up, hearts face up, clubs and diamonds face up. Those are they all go a bunch of face up aces. Face up to yeah. face down. Yeah. For right now, I'm just gonna get rid of the deck. We don't need that. So watch the first ace with just a shake. That should be ace number one has gone Whoa! face down. The second one happens quick. That's two aces. Oh my God. The hearts and spades. Now watch the ace of diamonds. I'll leave that face up all the way and very slowly push it in. With one more shake, that should leave just that ace of clubs uh -oh. face up. And then two taps and a shake. And that should be all four aces have gone face down. Stop that right now. Here's the best part. To reverse that action, I shake backwards. And that's one ace has now face up. If I shake like that, it actually changes places with the two, the three, and the four. See, when you weren't looking, I cheated. If we come back down over here, inside the deck, about 20 cards down, that's ace number one. Third, 12 cards away is ace number two, that's ace one and two. Now the third ace we know is with the uh, two, the three, and the four. And to get that fourth ace, I just take the third and rip it, and I get all four aces. Now, follow-up question, where did you study witchcraft? <laughs> These are my cards. Those are my cards. There is no pixie dust or sticky flappies or anything like that. That was legit. That was legit. That was legit. Hey guys, what's going on? Spidey here. I'm at Weir's Beach in New Hampshire. It's a great day outside. The beach is down that way. There's the train apparently. But I'm uh, here at the uh, Penny Arcade waiting for my friend Adam Wilbur, who's a sick magician. And we're gonna see if I could uh, kick his ass at some arcades. Check it out, guys. Adam Wilbur versus Spidey. So Adam Wilbur uh, just got here and I've got a pack of Achillean envelopes for him and this is going to be funny to see his reaction because he works over at uh, Illusionist. He's actually one of the top guys at Illusionist and this is a Theory 11 product but he knows it's awesome. So I'm really curious to see what his reaction is going to be because we're really good friends but we work for like opposing websites. So this is going to be awesome. Serious badass over here. Woo. We heard him coming 20 minutes away. That was quite a ride. What's up, bro? I didn't know you were such a badass. Mr. Wilbur. <laughs> yes, sir. Courtesy of Spidey and Theory 11, we have your very own pack of Achillean envelopes. Oh, right on. Very cool. Thank no, you, dude. Now you have no choice Psyched but... to use these. Anytime good magic is put out, I'm happy. I don't care who is with. Boom. There you have it from Team Illusionist. Quote, unquote, anytime good magic is put out, Adam's a happy guy. You can see these are all like doodles of fruits and stuff. And then as I go through this, this is like the Teenage Ninja nice. Turtle weapons. And then this is like school supplies mm -hmm. and uh, outdoorsy things. And uh, that's like modes of transportation. And you'll see like most of these have five or six different things on it. That's body parts and uh, 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 outer space things. Uh, uh, so as you can see, as, as I go through this, it's like literally hundreds of different drawings, right? It's vegetables. You can see that, right? Yeah. Here's what I want you to do. Hold out your hand. And I'm gonna put that there, bring your thumb over. Go ahead and just riffle your thumb up as you look over here and stop at any point you like, okay? Got it? Yep. Okay, look at the page you stopped at. Is there a bunch of different things you could think of? Yep. Do you recognize all of them? Yep. Okay, just think of any one of them. Got it? Close the pad when you're done and set it down. For the first time, and nothing's set up here, for the first time, tell the camera what object you were thinking of. A desktop computer. So, not a laptop, it was like an actual computer. This box has been sitting here the entire time, yes? It was right in front of me over here, I've not touched it. And I want you to notice that there's no like, um, weird like compartments or anything like that, no way to access it. Uh, however, you'll hear inside, 
I don't know if you can hear this, listen. You hear that there's something in there, right? There's actually a piece of paper. I'm gonna do this right here so you can see that there's only one piece of paper in there. And I'm gonna dump it out like this. You could have opened up at any page, thought of any drawing, you thought of a desktop computer. I don't wanna to touch it. You take that drawing, open it up, and tell the camera <laughs> it is a desktop That's great. computer. That's great. Like that a lot. Get it. All right, guys, so here is the ultimate ski ball competition between Team Illusionist and Theory 11. Let's do this. Let's get crushed, son. But I think Team Illusion has just got crushed, son! Four of the board, baby. That's what I get for beating you at ski ball. Look at my spring, look at, look at dribble. And then a, and then a spring. All right, guys, that was it for me. I'm headed uh, back home to Canada after an awesome day at Weir's Beach. Do me a favor, comment and like this video. Let me know if you could spend a day with any magician or any mentalist, who would it be? A lot of you have been asking about the tutorial for hypnosis, how to hypnotize your friends. That's coming later this week. Give me a comment if you're excited to learn some hypnosis on this channel for the first time. And I'm gonna start doing some tutorials for you guys. Thanks for watching, guys. I'll see you soon. Peace.